wakati mwingine alienda akamwambia pika kuku si yeye naye anaweka tu hiyo ndani back to the Kenyan family so my name is Sylvia but you can call me Slivy and welcome to this channel so today's video it's a very fun video I'm going to show you how you prepare Kuku Kenyeji as you have seen from the title so I know it's very hard for most of you to find Kuku Kenyeji but since we are at Ushago, we are going to show you Sasa and it's not all the parts there is no there is not that part of uh, killing it and uh, the part of removing the manure so I'll start from where it has already already been killed so it's the cutting part and also the cooking part is not there yeah so it's basically how you cut it and how you operate it the <laughs> the inside parts you know yeah so that's about this video hope you'll enjoy it and if you've not subscribed please subscribe yeah. okay this is just after it was slaughtered. Which is it slaughter. After slaughtering, I did show you where you mean it. You put it in the hot water so that you can remove the manure. So after that, the order to cut it into pieces. You're not cutting it as good. So this next part it's when we want to open it in the inside that's what she's doing like opening it up so that you can remove them the inside parts of it yeah so you just try <coughs> hitting it that way after you open you can move with the inner styles and so on and so forth. You are yellow, ni mafuta. Because it is almost to. You can take a nice answer for that. So oh, this is how the inside part looks like. And those are the intestines there. What you need to do is remove them. So the next step, you start removing the um, all parts that are on the inside. Yeah, like that's the throat. Let's say the throat. That's where the food passes from. Yeah, that's what has been removed. Then, next, you just remove all those all those inside parts. Can you see the yellow yellowish thing? That stuff is the natural oil for the chicken. So, while cooking this particular chicken, you don't even need to use any more oil. Because, can you see, it has a lot of oil. 
so when removing those parts you need to be very very careful because there is uh part there are the green yeah that that one when it ruptures it will make the whole chicken to be bitter so you need to be careful with removing the intestines and all that yeah so basically it's uh, those parts in there it's the intestines liver and gizzard yeah you just see it has a lot of oil yeah so you just remove them place them somewhere can you see the gizzard and the liver and the intestines yeah, and then you go on with with the cutting your chicken into pieces you see all this a special person so this particular chicken was just meant for visitors that's why it was cut like this into very big pieces so that it can just be served like that once so but if you may wish you may cut them into the smaller pieces but this one we decided to cut just bigger pieces yeah so don't mind so this part this part is the the back the back of the chicken and what you see there those are its eggs it has started it had started forming eggs because it was about to lay eggs yeah so that one you can't even divide it just put it the way it is and can you see all that oil so someone someone who eats that part eats with all those eggs so next we're going to handle the uh, intestine part and now we are going to meet that green part i don't know its name but i'll put it there so by bad luck it ruptured can you see but again by good luck that it ruptured only on the intestines which even is not that necessary we can just throw it away but when we wash it it will be fine and most people never eat intestines but for us we're going to prepare it yeah and see how we are going to do it so next we go to the gizzard part and uh, when handling the gizzard you need to beat it like that what she's doing so that it can be easier for you to cut it yeah, so you need to cut the gizzard, open it up, and remove the dirt. It always has dirt. Yeah, see, all that is dirt. So you need to cut it up and remove the dirt. And also there is that part. Ooh. But it's sweet. <laughs> see your navy. So you open it up, remove the dirt, and also there is that inner part of it. Yeah, that one. You remove it. Yeah, that is to be removed. Yeah, so don't, <laughs> don't put it like that. We eat intestines. Do you do that at your home? So after doing all that you go wash your chicken 
so that it can be ready for cooking now so the next step is you wash it very properly yeah Add some water to your chicken to boil not so much just a little water like what I've put there mm -hmm. 